And I'm just going to go ahead and prophesy that the call of God is already on this young man's life. Because that which has come down from the top, from the heritage, is resting upon him. And he will impact his generation. So, Lord, I just prophesy that over him. In Jesus' name, I, I, that's the Lord. I, I asked the Lord today, what do you want to say over little Noah? And, and that's what I heard the Holy Spirit say. And so we're going to dedicate him today. And, and uh, I'm going to let Isaac start off by making a prayer of dedication. And then, uh, of course, uh, his father, Grandpa, uh, Dr. Tim. And then uh, I'll, I'll close with a prayer of blessing over him. And, and uh, okay. You know, Pastor, I figured as a staff member, we're required, you know, to help grow the church. I figured one way to do that is to uh, start having kids. And, you know, in our family line, my parents had six of us. So hopefully I can help grow the church in some way. You know, I wrote mine out because I really wanted to be prepared. And, uh, you know, my dad, when we were young, he prayed a nation over each of us. And I believe that God's going to call little Noah into the nations as well and to be all over the globe reaching people for Jesus. So let's pray. Lord, I thank you for Noah Isaac. Lord, in dedicating Noah, we acknowledge your sovereignty, not only over our child, but also over Liz and I. We present our child to you asking for grace and wisdom in carrying out our responsibilities as godly parents and leaders. I pray that at an early age, Noah will trust you as savior for the forgiveness of sin. I pray that Noah will have a heart for the nations and the world, that you will use him in a mighty way to reach many for the kingdom. Let Noah be a mighty man of God and a mighty leader to the next generation. Father, and I do claim what pastor just prophesied. I believe that, that he will be a rest to this next generation, that he'll bring rest. His name Noah means peaceable and comforter. And so Lord, that goes right in line. And Father, we just, Claim, Lord God, that you will use Noah in a powerful way. In Jesus' name. Father, we just thank you for the gifts that you give to us. And we thank you, Lord, for the gift of our children. We realize truly, Lord, that they are a blessing from the Lord. Lord, I thank you for godly parents who love you, who desire to serve you and to offer back to you their gifts, their talents, their ties, as well as their family to you, Lord Jesus. We just ask now that you will put a hedge about this home, first on their marriage, protect them in this world, Lord, where there's so much attack on the home. Guard their minds and their hearts. Keep them focused on you, Lord. I pray that Isaac will be the father, the husband, the leader that he needs to be in this house, an example to his son. I pray that Liz will have a special anointing as mother and Lord that she'll nurture and care for this child as you love us and you talk about how much you care for us, Lord. And let Noah always see stability and rest in his own home, Lord Jesus. We pray that it will be a place of peace. We pray, Lord, for Noah that you will protect him in this world, that you'll put your covering about him physically, emotionally, spiritually, in every way. When he's old enough, he'll receive you. And Lord, he will go on to be used of you, Lord. And whatever he does in life, that he'll be totally dedicated to serving you in your kingdom. And Lord, we just thank you for the many, many gifts that you give us. But again, for this special gift, the gift of life, Lord, through birth. And thank you, Lord, for the safe and healthy delivery. And we look forward now, Lord, to what you have in store for him. And for this family, in Jesus' name. Yes, Lord, and I just declare over little Noah Isaac daily, your hand of protection and blessing. Father, you said that children are like arrows in the hand of a warrior. And Lord, as this little child is shaped and formed and then aimed into the destiny and purpose of God for his life, we just declare your blessing over him. And Lord, I just declare that he is emotionally stable, that he will be mentally alert, physically strong and healthy, and spiritually steadfast, called and blessed by you, almighty God. Thank you for your hand upon his life and for the heritage that he has, Father, Lord, not only in his parents 
And, but Lord, in his grandparents, Lord, we ask your blessing upon them in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Praise God. Thank you.